please. Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please. I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. 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 Today's video takes us to the great state of Pennsylvania with a stop at the Mercer County Correctional Facility. Now, who in their bloody mind would want to record a correctional facility? Why, the Long Island loser, of course. Why does he do this? I have no clue. Is he trying to get arrested again? It appears so. Let's all sit back, watch, have a good laugh, and most of all, <laughs> enjoy! Today we are at the Mercer County Correctional Facility here in Pennsylvania. We are here today, as always, to peacefully right, exercise gentlemen. Let's take a look around the facility here. So this correctional officer here has been on the phone. Just follow me around, watching me. Or he could just come up to me and ask me what I'm doing. I'll tell him I'm taking some pictures in public. Not a big deal, exercising my First Amendment right. But he wants to be all cloak and dagger about it. So we have another friendly reminder that the government's always watching us. You see, what Sean says doesn't make a lot of sense. He says they're always watching us, but it's a problem when we watch them. This is a prison, you moron. They need cameras in case something happens. What, what is wrong with Sean? Really, what is wrong with him? Was he dropped on his head as a small child? I mean, what? What happened? Hey, how are you? Who are you, sir? Lieutenant, you're at the I know where I am. Uh, Lieutenant? Yeah. Lieutenant what? Lieutenant Hood. Lieutenant Hood? Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Sean. Why are you walking around the building here? I'm just taking some pictures. Okay, but you can't go around outside of the jail. Oh, I'm not going in to any restricted areas or anything, Lieutenant. I'm just taking around, a look around the publicly accessible areas. Now I have to ask you good people because maybe I'm stupid and I don't know. What are the publicly accessible areas in and around the prison? And why would you want to access them? Yeah, it's a place filled with people who aren't very nice in our society. That's why they're there in the first place. And you want to mingle with these people, Sean? Is that what you want to do? Yeah, this is a sidewalk, right? That's where I was walking. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Alright, let's take a look around the other side. Continue to walk on the sidewalk with the lieutenant. And uh, another correctional officer here. What the hell is wrong with Sean, though? No, really, I'm serious. What is wrong with him? But yeah, I'm on the sidewalk. Well, I got news for you, sweetheart. That's not a sidewalk that's publicly accessible to the masses. That's a sidewalk that goes around a prison. Yeah, the real sidewalk's out there by the street. And maybe you want to sit in those benches over there by the flags. Want to sit over there and get some sun? Yeah, that'd be a nice restful place to sit, huh? Until there was a prison break. A few minutes later. Ladies and gentlemen, so it looks like law enforcement has arrived. I'm not exactly sure if they're here for us. Actually, now I'm pretty sure that they are here to speak with us. <laughs> Hey, how are you, sir? What's going on? Do you, are you here for some reason? Because the jail's concerned. Oh, I spoke to the lieutenant. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see. He came out and I spoke to the lieutenant. What did he say? Um, he said if I was going to go, I couldn't go around the facility here. And I told him I didn't. I was just walking in the publicly accessible areas. You mind if I get your name and badge number, sir? 12086. My name's right there. Right there. Yeah, okay. you can get it on your camera. Okay, great. You're being filmed visually and audibly as well. Okay. Just letting you know. I have to let you know. Okay. So... Um, a lot of officers name right there. What's that? <laughs> a lot of officers name right there. A lot of officers name right here. Right here. Yeah, yeah we put we put ours here. Okay, Others, great. I don't know yeah. where they put theirs, but uh... uh Sean, your attempt at humor failed. Sean tried to clown the officer with that right here nonsense. It backfired though, didn't it, Sean? Well, maybe next time, sweetheart. So you talked to the lieutenant. Did he yeah. Say what his name was. 
Yeah. Um, he told me I forgot. It was a few minutes ago, okay. but I forgot. Yeah. Okay. You just are you just like filming for like, yeah, I'm just, a project? Or yeah. Something? So I'm just taking some pictures and video. Um, my name's Sean. I'm okay. working on a uh, on a story for this correctional facility, and I'm just taking pictures of the grounds, getting some B-roll footage okay. of Did the publicly accessible it was areas. Okay? Um, he didn't, he said I couldn't go around so, the correctional so here's, facility. Here's the deal, just being straightforward. Yeah, sure, so sure. obviously I'm here for a reason. I didn't just show up right. randomly and right, right, contact right. with you. And, uh, um, but the jail called, they said that you were walking around near the fences. And I can confirm that with the complaint in the jail and then taking filming inside vehicles. Right. So I was filming the, uh, correctional vehicles there. Yeah. Yeah. Frauditors love to film inside their vehicles. Little Davy's the king of that. He loves to film all his New York police vehicles. Those are his. He paid for them with his tax money. They belong to him. The ones belonging to the state. Okay. Because like I said, I'm working on a story. I so you. I was filming those vehicles. I wasn't filming any personal vehicles, but okay. I mean, filming personal vehicles isn't so even a crime. Like, just like a, no, no, I never said it was. But, right. Um, you know. But this, I wasn't doing that, just so you know. This is, hey, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> You have to understand this is a jail, and I'm not saying this is suspicious. Obviously, I'm talking with you and getting right. your understanding and everything. Right, right. You're doing it for like a project. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just working on a personal project of mine, um, and uh, about the jail. Yeah. And I uh, received some complaints about the jail, some information that I was just wanted to get some B-roll footage here. Take just take pictures in the publicly accessible areas. Okay. You know, like I said, the first person that came out to me and speak to me was the lieutenant. I was right around that corner of the. About uh, how long ago was it? Probably about. I would say like five, ten minutes ago, right. between there. And he said you're okay as long as... So, he didn't tell me... He, it was a very short conversation. He said, you can't be walking around the jail. Okay. And he and meant, you weren't doing that, right? No. And he's okay. and I said, I was walking on the sidewalk, so right here, to where yeah. there was a front door. Frauditors are such good liars, aren't they? Sean claims he received some reports that there was misgivings going on in the jail. You didn't receive any damn report. You just want to come out there and record and see what happens. Sean hopes to get arrested. That way he can file a federal lawsuit and claim that his rights were violated. Yeah, well, if you go to the right jail, you'll have more than your rights violated. I can tell you that, boy. And he was like, okay. Yeah. And then he kind of just walked away. And, and I guess it, that's when they, when they called you just to have you handle it. Because we'll, I don't know we'll if they're, they're not law enforcement. Well, we'll assume. Um, right. So he didn't kick you off or anything or tell you you couldn't do it. He just told you you can't walk around the jail. Yeah, walk around the backside of the jail. And I told him my intention is not to go any restricted areas. You know, I just want to go. Yeah. I just want to be in the publicly accessible it, areas. I mean, it is a jail. You never know what people were doing here at the jail. You know? Right. And that's sort of what. I mean, if somebody, I guess, I guess like Google Earth can probably get me a better, you know, look. If I was looking out schematics of the jail, I probably could just Google Earth view it, figure out this all sides of the jail, you know, but. That's not my intention. I, you know, broad daylight, you know, yeah, recording. No, I, get it. I, I don't get think it. that leads any suspicion up to nefarious are, activities. Are you almost done, or are you going to be? Yeah, just a few more minutes, and I'll be out of here. Yeah, just a few more minutes. So I'm just going to tell you, and I can confirm it. They they want you to go. They want you to leave. Oh, I do apologize, trooper, but Sean can't leave. And if you make him leave, that'd be a violation of the press and his First Amendment of speech and all kinds of stuff. And you know what Sean will do? He'll file a federal lawsuit on you, trooper, and guess what? You'll lose your qualified immunity. Hmm. Well, that's what I'm told, anyway. Okay, okay, this is public property, sir. Well, it's... This is public? Yeah, this is public property. Okay, well, I'll confirm that with the jail, and it's up to them. Um, but anybody can be on public property anytime. I'm well, not breaking any laws. if you're doing suspicious things, like they're saying you're filming in cars, that's suspicious in itself. Right. I mean, filming. And you go work. around areas by the fences. That's you know. There is there is actually no fences in this jail, okay. so I don't know where they would say. Okay. Do you see any fence? There is no fences. It's a completely sealed in by walls. But well, I'm just going off what they're saying. Right, 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 right. And 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 all I'm saying is that you know this is open to the public. This is not a restricted area. There's a restricted area back there. There's restricted areas in the back. I confirm with you know, I'm not in a restricted not area. Not off if you can't. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like like I said, it's just public area. You know, people okay. have a right to be in public. All right. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah, okay, right, so you're going to talk to them? Yeah, sure, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. What's your first, just your Sean, name? Sean, nice Sean. You, John. No, Sean, sir. Or Sean, Sean. Sorry. Yeah, there you go. Nice to meet you, too. I think everybody should take a few moments and send Sean a thank you email. That's right, you should thank him, because if you're driving by a prison one day and you get the urge to record it, you can pull in the parking lot, take out your cell phone camera, and have no fear of recording. 
there be no fear of retribution, because Sean has paved the way. That's right. So this Pennsylvania State Trooper here, Trooper right here. You know, I know it bothers a lot of you out there just like it bothers me. It's just unprofessional, right? You know, just hi, my name is Trooper so-and-so. Very simple. It's not that hard to do. It's really not that big of a deal um, just to properly identify yourself. So I really don't understand it. Because like if one of if their supervisor, you know, that didn't know them or a judge asked them for their name, they wouldn't say, it's right here, judge. It's just a level of respect that you should have for the public. Real nefarious what I'm doing. You can get this all from Google Street View. Or if I wanted to do it surreptitiously and just, you know, drive my car around. You know, very restricted area. See Domino's? Very restricted, highly restricted area we're in. Well, while Sean's walking around the parking lot, another Pennsylvania state trooper arrives. Because it's not every day you see some guy walking around a prison with a video camera. Okay, yeah, let's see what happens. A few minutes later. Mind if I get your name and badge number? Trooper Sackinger, 12793. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. You good with that? My name is Sean, by the way. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll just let him know. All right, all right. Thanks, LT. All right, all right, bye-bye. All right. The LT says he asked you to leave. Um, it's on you camera. Said he didn't. That's fine. I'm not. Let me finish. Yeah. Okay. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm just. Conclusions. Uh, no, I'm. Uh, I, one word, two words on camera. That's it. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I mean, it is what it is. But uh, he's fine with you being here. I talked to him about it. He's fine. He's just asked for one thing. He said, just don't go out into that area or out on the grass. He's yeah, no restricted areas. Yeah, no restricted areas. I said, areas. you've been, you're giving no problems. I don't expect you're doing anything bad. You're here for filming for, for something Yeah, just like taking, that. yeah, just and taking they pictures in public. they couldn't clarify to me if this was public or not, so I'm not going to violate your rights. Okay, and perfect. You. All right, perfect. that's not what we're about here. Okay, good. Okay, just I appreciate that, yeah. Just don't put yourself in that situation. Right. Yeah, like I said, anybody me. anybody that comes up to me and, yeah. you know, they're reasonable with me, I'll tell them, you know, I'm just taking some pictures in public. Yeah. My name is Sean. Nothing nefarious going on here. Okay. All right, good people. We're going to cut it right there, although the video continues for several more moments. Sean is just talking his nonsense about how he has rights. Yeah, Sean seems to go in spurts, though. He does certain things. He goes to city halls, and he goes to county buildings. And right now, he's on prisons. I don't know how much longer this nonsense is going to last, but it seems rather silly to me. Go out and film a prison. Crazy, man. But anyway, if you enjoy watching stupid people do stupid things on my channel, please subscribe. Also, check out Dr. Dave's website at drdave.media. You'll see some real fools over there. And Dr. Dave has a host of social media sites. Just go to Google and type in Dr. Dave the Bunker. You'll find every single website I'm on. Yeah. Well, in the meantime, I wonder if Sean will ever get a real job again. What do you think? Probably not. His wife would divorce him. No doubt about it. Cheers to that. I've actually studied English, and uh, I have a, over a 400-level education in English. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? Oh, no I'm reason really, to have... I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. We're going to arrest you for trespassing in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, she's right in my face, guys. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the law. Do. Oh, is that like a law? It's against the law. Oh, what law is that? Funny, because I've never heard about that. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? You work for me, right? You're just a little guy. You're just a little guy. You work for me. You are a public servant. You are a public servant. You work for me. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. You assaulted me. She assaulted me. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Take a swing. Take a swing. You go to jail? Go ahead, put your hands on me. Put your hands on me. Salam alhamdulillah. Alu Akbar!
Ignorance of the law is not an excuse. I'm being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby, so. So, if you want to take out that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. If you want to do it, you let's do it. Let me know, buddy. Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Why don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm gonna be You hit me. Okay. Okay. You take my picture, dude. I don't know you. I said I broke your shoulder. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, you know, we need help getting hotels. I have been putting in job applications, and it's. I, I don't know any job where you walk up to it, fill out the application, and they hire you right on the spot. She spit me on my face right now. She spit in my face. Right now, she spit in my face. I got a camera. $60, guys, is what we're trying to raise. So if you can help out, contribute towards it, feel free to donate, guys. I won't ever ask for money on this channel again. You touch my phone, you can't touch my phone. Okay, you touch my phone. Why did you touch my phone? She touched my property. Hey, what's up, guys? So we're here at the America's Best Value. Um, we're trying to get a room. I'm asking for help. Please, guys. I need y'all's help. You can't solicit a trespass, bro. You just solicited a trespass. I asked her what she wanted. No, you can't say, do you want them trespassing? You can't use that line. She touched my phone. I got it on a video. I want to arrest her. I want to arrest her. I want you, you're gonna go to jail now. <laughs> We're a little low on funds, guys. Uh, so I wanna make a quick video. If there's any way you guys can help out, uh, we're trying to get a room. I'm gonna pay you too, okay? Right. You're done already, I got you in all videos. This is a public sidewalk, she touched me. She touched my phone, okay? okay. This is an expensive phone. This is almost 1200 okay? Mrs. Potato's breaking my balls, everyone. <laughs> She's straight up breaking my balls. I will never beg you for it. I won't beg nobody for nothing. Please don't touch me. Step sir, outside. Sir, sir, what are you doing? I, I what are you doing? Donate to the PayPal if you can help out. If you can't, I understand. The PayPal link below. So if any of you would like to send me some money to help me out, I could greatly use it, but I'm not begging you for it. So just leave. I live here! Listen, you have a bipolar problem. You're bipolar. You're having a bipolar episode. Everybody hit the like button. Everybody hit the like button. You threatened me in my room like a little bitch. And if you want to take it to the street, we can do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Go ahead. Let's do it. So I was cutting the grass with a pair of scissors, just tidying up the, instead of using a weed whacker, sometimes I use scissors because I'm really fast. Go Keep go your ahead. distance, bitch. You Keep your swing? distance. Then, then go ahead. Keep you your distance, me, bitch. You me and that's your ass. Keep your distance, you bitch. I will sue you. You can sue anybody you want, anytime you want. If, if, if they do, I will sue him first because he's in charge. You're in charge, right? You're the guy in charge. You're the one who gets listed on the lawsuit.